I went to a Buddhist temple last Sunday. So I don't even know why I went, but actually, the Sunday before last week, I had a dream that I had gone to a Buddhist temple. The dream was lucid enough for me to mention the strangeness to my sister. That same Sunday, I had gone to go pick up some plants that I bought. On my way back, I decided on a whim to use a different way home, and then I came across a Buddhist temple. So at this point, two out of the way things had happened, and I thought, hmm, is the universe trying to tell me something? So I promised that I would go check out the temple. This Sunday last Sunday there were three Asian ladies just sat there staring at me curious about my arrival there were no chairs but there were pillows on the ground about seven people were sat cross-legged on these pillows the room was filled with the tranquility and fragrance of incense and so I sat cross-legged trying to make myself as inconspicuous as possible which was futile because I'm literally the only black person there <laughs> The service started with a loud gong and they were saying mantras in Vietnamese. I don't know Vietnamese, it's a new religion. I got scared. So I was born and raised Christian and as Christians we were taught to not interact with the spirituality of others and that there was only one true religion. My mind, I'm like blood of Jesus, blood of Jesus, what have I gotten myself into? Who sent me to come here? But logic kicked in. I came here with a clean heart. I came here to familiarize myself with the unknown and I don't think a good God will punish me for that. I got the brilliant idea to use Google Lens to translate the two pamphlets that were placed in front of us. The pamphlet was basically talking about seeking wisdom and understanding and living your life with the understanding that death is on the way, that every second that passes that we're inching closer and closer to our death. And what we do in life determines our karma in the afterlife. Basically, just sowing seeds of goodness, love, kindness, and finding inner peace. And like, who doesn't want that? <laughs> Unlike the spiritual high you get after like a Christian sermon, I really appreciated the quiet simplicity of the service. I was strangely calm in my disposition and honestly left solidifying my already existing belief that religion is really just religion. I feel like I make a lot of tree analogies, but I view God as a tree and we are the branches and the branches represent your spirituality, your religion. Doesn't matter how you call on God as long as you call on God. So I stayed for two hours and left shortly after the service ended, leaving the Vietnamese woman as curious as when I had arrived.